Hello everyone, my name is Quad Damage. Today is Friday the 1st of August. It is 78 degrees here in beautiful Michigan. And today we're going a little bit retro. This is Blake Stone, Aliens of Gold. It was released in 1993 on an enhanced Wolf 3D engine. And Doom was released one week later and that killed sales. So, But that's just a little bit of a background for you. This is a really, really fun game. Um, I had a lot of fun playing it as a kid. Like I said, it was released in 1993, which is going to make some of you feel old. Well, I'm sorry, but I was two when this came out, so I didn't play it exactly when it came out. I played it later. But I played it nearly every day, and I and that's, that's why I wanted to start this video. And, and hopefully make this a series because I'd like to do retro great games because I want to reminisce and uh, have some a bit of nostalgia around here and uh, enjoy these games that I played when I was a kid. Um, I played this game with my uncles <laughs> which you know I played it by myself but mostly it was more fun to me with my uncles. We had uh, I would sit on one side of the keyboard and one of my uncles would sit on the other and they were in charge of movement or driving as I called it back then. They would drive Blake Stone around and I was in charge of spacebar to open the door and control to fire. We didn't use shift for run because, well, this stuff moved a little quickly for them and you know how some people get, the stomach gets a little queasy. So. Um, if you like Wolf 3D, this is a super fun sci-fi first-person shooter that you should try. Um, it's it's not exactly like Wolf 3D, but if you enjoyed Wolf 3D, think of this as a sci-fi version. But of course, with bigger monsters, big green monsters, those things used to scare me so bad when I was a kid. It was terrifying, but here, you can see, I played this so much, I still remember where secrets in the level were. I, probably before I got this on Steam, I hadn't played this probably since, oh, uh, 2004, 3, somewhere in there. And I still remember how to do, that, that tells you you had no friends when you were younger. <laughs> but, uh, it, it's just so cool the way the art's done in this game and just how the ammo pickups work and, and you see there it's not a it's not exactly like Wolfen. some people will try to kill you and some people won't like this guy in here I don't believe he's yeah he's a good guy you press spacebar on him you talk to him and you see yeah he's not gonna kill me that's fine but some of them will and it's it's really cool because you know as a little kid you want to just keep hitting that control button keep killing people and well it, it almost in a way taught me not to judge a book by its cover I know that sounds kind of strange but I mean if we just kind of look just get away from the retro thing for for a minute think about this as it's supposed to be you are a guy in the future and you're a secret agent and you walk into this building there's gold everywhere and apparently you have a gold smelting plant in your pocket where you're incredibly strong because you are picking up gold bars for days they're leaving ammo on the floor health kits on the floor don't mind the robot and for some reason the access card now you would think they'd want to keep that locked up or on some sort of officials uh, lanyard or something like that but no they just leave it on the floor same thing with candy bars if you play this game you'll see candy bars and sandwiches on the ground but I mean, yeah, let's just freelance a bunch of food and gold and ammo and stuff on the ground. Like in here, I'm about to pick up raw meat off the ground. You'll see it in a second. Raw meat. Just just on the ground. Just steak and what I assume is mutant leg. I don't know. Like, yep, and nom nom. I'm just eating. I don't understand it. <laughs> but I'm going to make more of these. I really enjoyed this. And if you enjoyed, please hit like, consider subscribing, leave me a comment, let me know what I did well or didn't do so well. I hope you guys have a great day, and I will see you in the next video.